Today we're using the Master Cool flaring tool. We'll be using 3 8 line. This will be turned into a gas line in a car project that we are doing. Um, I have this little piece cut to length. First thing I like to do is take all the burrs off it. It makes rolling this edge much easier um, and nothing catches the dies as you're doing it. So I just take some sandpaper, I hit that outside edge, feel it with your fingers. And if you have a deburring tool like this, this works great getting inside little tooling. Let's do that a few times. All right, that feels pretty good. Now we're gonna be running a 45 degree inverted flare. This is the first step. You take this die right here, and you gotta stick this and clamp in the hydraulic cylinder. And then this is your die that you put it in. This slides in, here's your stop. This sets the length on it so you know exactly how far to put it in. Slide it in, just, you can feel it rub up against it. And once you hit your stop here, that's the length you want. Next is you tighten this down. This will take your die and actually smash it together around that tube. And you don't have to crank it so tight that you're smashing it, but you'll, you'll feel it kind of tighten up on itself. Right there, it feels pretty good. All right, so you pull your stop out of the way. Next step is you start pumping and then make sure that this nipple right here gets started inside of that tube. If you're on the edge of it, it'll smash it and you have to start over. And just start pumping it. And you'll feel it right when it gets to it, it'll tighten up right there. Now it's got pressure, now it'll start bending. You just slowly just start, right, right there. Now it's sacked out, I'm gonna give it one more little quarter of a squeeze, release it all the way back, pull that die out, put this one in, it's just shaped like a cone, this will give you your 45 degree inside flare on it. And same deal, make sure you get started straight, get there tighten up. And this one you don't have to smash as hard, just give it a little brief right here down there. There's your inverted 45 flare. If you're running AN fittings, this would slide on here like that with your tube nut, and then that would go on whatever kind of AN fitting you're threading into.